welcome back to my channel what I have for you today is some good old turkey chili okay and what you're gonna need you're gonna need uh, a quarter of a small bell pepper and this is uh, maybe a half of a small bell pepper and I have yellow onion uh, white onion and then I have a can of stewed tomatoes and I have a can of kidney beans which I might use two cans of stewed tomatoes because I love stewed tomatoes but we'll see and I have about a pound a pound of ground turkey meat and without further ado let's get started I'm going to be cooking this in my Dutch oven Break this up a little bit. And I'm going to add my onions. I also forgot to mention that I do use a chili brick with my chili. Um, I have half of a chili brick. This is well, this is what my mom used to call it, a chili brick. But it's really chili con carne. And this is what I put into my chili. It makes your chili really, really um, creamy, smooth, and delicious. It thickens it. Okay. This is uh, chili con carne. Okay. And I normally wait until... Uh, I get all my ingredients in because all that needs to do is melt down, okay? But it really, really makes your chili nice and creamy and delicious, okay? Thickens it. Okay. Just about got it all browned up. And I'm going to get rid of some of this water. Pour in my bell pepper, my green bell pepper, and my yellow bell pepper. I'm going to pour in about a cup of water. And I'm going to start seasoning my, my meat. Now I'm just going to eyeball this. I don't really do measurements on the seasoning. So there's my chili powder. And that was probably around... A half a teaspoon, but now I'm not going to go berserk with my seasoning. There's my pink Himalayan salt. Garlic powder. And that's probably going to be around a, table, a teaspoon and a teaspoon of onion powder. Cayenne pepper, about an eighth of a teaspoon. Not that much. I don't want it to be too hot because I'm going to take my mom some. And I am going to crush two cloves of garlic in here too. Uh, I forgot about my garlic, but I got to have it. Cloves of garlic. That's about three cloves right there. Three cloves of fresh garlic. Okay. I'm gonna put some 
more chili powder. No, I didn't put enough. I forgot I bought that chili seasoning. I never use that. to use it. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and use my, put my uh, chili brick in, half of it. Oh shoot, making a mess. Now how many of y'all know about this chili brick? <laughs> Once it's melted down, you'll see that it, it's, it's going to thicken up a little bit, okay? It's going to thicken up a lot, okay? So, I'm going to cover this up, and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm getting ready to go ahead and add my stewed tomato. my beans. I rinsed them. Rinsed them and I drained them. Starting to look like some good old chili. And I know I'm going to have to put some more seasoning, but right now I'm just going to let this simmer and I'll be right back. Add a little celery seed, just a little bit. And a little bit of cumin. This is probably about a teaspoon. Stir that up, let it simmer. Smoked paprika. You see how thick it has gotten? And it's because of that chili brick. The color, the thickness. And it's going to probably get a little thicker the more it cooks. So I'll turn down the crushed red, red peppers. So I did add about a half a teaspoon of honey, just a little bit, okay? All right, y'all, here we go. Ooh, wee. Ooh, mmm. Stir that on up. It's done. It is done. Sure, I got me some tomatoes in there. Everything. Beans. Oh, that looks so good. Here's my dinner. And I think I'm a Grate me a little bit of this Parmesan cheese over my vegetables. Mmm, 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 mmm. All right, let's give it a taste test. I got my these gluten-free uh, hmm, multi-seed snack crackers instead of saltines. This is the same bottle that I had, not the same bottle, but the same kind that I had, Bellini, but it's a uh, strawberry. Mm. And it's delicious. 
It doesn't taste like the orange. The orange is, it doesn't taste as good as the orange. Of course, it doesn't taste like the orange, but it doesn't taste as good as the orange. It's pretty good, though. All right. Let's give it a taste. Good. Really, really good. You guys, get that chili block. Kroger. Where I get it from? Kroger or Walmart? I think I got it from Kroger. <clears throat> it's really good. Makes your chili just pop. Makes it pop. Makes it taste really good. Mm. I had to make me some vegetables on the side. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, okay guys, if you like my channel, please subscribe. And I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. Mm. Oh my goodness. And it's not hot. She's going to like it. She might think it's a little spicy, but it's not. It's delicious. And these crackers aren't bad either. Not bad at all. And you can have about 13 of them. Leave me a nice comment. And I'll see you guys next video. Alright? Love you. Peace.